Good Wednesday to you. I'm meteorologist Greg Bledsoe, and here's what your Thursday has in store. A little bit nicer as far as our overnight hours. We're not going to be dealing with that marine layer, so that's going to mean sunshine from the get-go on Thursday. Mostly sunny skies throughout the day, slightly warmer temperatures as well. Uh, Santa Ana winds brewing mostly to our north. However, our local mountains are going to get breezy overnight tonight, lasting into Thursday morning. And then we have a chance for some rain out over our mountains from Thursday through Sunday, and a chance, slight chance anyways, that a shower or two could drift west of the mountains into our inland valleys. For tonight, temperatures are going to be a little bit cooler than we have been over the last couple of nights. Low 50s for the coast, mid 40s for the inland valleys. Again, mostly clear skies. We're not dealing with that deep marine layer that we've been dealing with the last couple of nights. As for the mountains, winds are going to be picking up tonight. We'll take a look at that in a moment. 37 degrees, your overnight low for our mountains and upper 40s for the desert areas. Temperatures for your Thursday, I mentioned a little bit warmer. Take a look at this. Mid to upper 60s for the beaches and pretty much the same story for the inland valleys. Not a big difference in our temperatures between the inland areas and the coastal areas for Thursday. Pretty much everywhere in that 65 to 69 degree range there. As we head out to the mountain areas, though, going to be a little bit on the cool side. Upper 40s, your high temperatures for the mountains, and again, a little bit breezy as well. So let's take a look at those winds. Primarily look at the arrows and then what happens to them when we go overnight tonight into Thursday morning. You see a lot more of those colors popping up, especially to our north. We'll talk about that in a moment. We're looking at offshore winds by Thursday morning, 20 to 30 mile per hour breezes for the mountains and even some of our North County coastal areas. The strongest winds though are going to be up to our north and that's where all the advisories and the warnings are as well. They could see some gusting in some parts of uh, Riverside, San Bernardino and Orange counties, 80 to 90 miles per hour possible, more so in the, in the 60 mile per hour range, but still some strong winds up to our north. We will not be dealing with that down here. However, uh, the same low pressure system that's fueling those winds is going to drop some moisture from the south and that could bring us a chance for some showers anytime Thursday through Sunday out over the mountain areas and you'll notice here on Friday the best chance for some showers for our mountains. We have a chance for our inland valleys there because some of that moisture could end up drifting west of the mountains. Other than that, the weekend's looking really nice. We're going to stay mostly dry. We'll see temperatures start to bump up and then a better warm up as we head into the early part of next week. You can see temperatures for the coast and the inland valleys well into the 70s by early next week. Taking a look at the mountains and deserts here and you see that rain chance basically Friday and Saturday. Uh, I could see something Thursday night or early Sunday, but the best chance for any rain for our mountains and deserts is going to be Friday and Saturday and then drying out and warming up as we head into next week.